What's up, guys? Out here at Paddle Sports Retailer 2018. Uh, jumping in a bunch of different packs. Do some demos today. Right now I'm in the Old Town Topwater, the new PDL. Out here getting it at the uh, River Park or River Sports Park in uh, Oklahoma City. This place is legit. There's a whitewater deal I'm going to try to get some photos of. And then the actual uh, flat water demo area here, which is basically a big wide river you can see. But I'm gonna go over the, the new old town real quick. Hope you guys a little heads up as these are, are hitting retailers pretty soon. It's kind of windy, so if the audio is not good, I apologize. First of all, we'll just start at the front. Pedal drive system looks real similar to what you've seen in the uh, Ocean Kayak, the, the Mal Malibu PDL, and the actual Old Town Predator PDL. Feels about the same when you're pedaling it. It's got a little different console in it than. Uh, Predator has, but it's got the same lock system like the Predator. In the front here, it's got a, a, a hatch access that's a little shallower than the actual Predator PDO. And on top, it's got some bungees, which is also different. You see the standing pads in the floor, some storage hatches on the side. It's got side uh, slide tracks built in on both sides. Dry storage up there in the front, a little smaller hatch, and it's kind of recessed down. Try to get that open and look at it. Uh, there's a drain plug up in the front, which is interesting. This new improved uh, steering actually locks the rudder. It's got a little control knob on it, which is nice. Uh, I wish I had this on my Predator, which I believe the new ones are going to have that option. You can actually tighten that tension. You need to. Uh, paddle clip on the side, molded in handles. Looking in the back, you see I got my backpack back there, but it's got a nice. For a short boat, 10 and a half feet, it's got a nice big tank well. Rod holders built in, rudder back there with the handle on this side. Rudder deployment handle moves uh, back and forth like this rather than up and down like the Predator PDL. Built in rod holder here. Seat is similar, but it's got a little different material to it. Rather than having a pouch under, you just got all this open area. Uh, nice standing pads. Let's get on it for a minute and see if you can get an idea about the speed. It gets up and goes for a little boat pretty well. And I did a little turn with it earlier. I'm going to do a, a quick 360. And it really hugs a, a sharp turn. It's got a nice big rudder. See that perspective there? And being a short boat probably makes it do that a little smoother. Predators are kind of known uh, for their stability, especially the PDLs, so I haven't stood up in this one yet. Let's give that a go. First time standing, pretty stable. I'm six foot three, long leg, and it's still plenty stable. Get off this bank. But yeah. Press a little boat. I know I've seen some other videos on it, seen some pictures of it, but it's my first time in it, and I couldn't be uh, couldn't be more impressed. Good price point, coming in under two thousand dollars. So excited to get my hands on one and rig it up so I can fish out of it. And uh, really happy I got to go over and, and go over this. There's a ton of other boats out here. I'm gonna get in the regular topwater series and paddle them around. Uh, I'm gonna jump in some other brands too while I'm out here. But uh, thanks for checking this one out. And I'll be posting some other videos up of the of the other boats here uh, in the coming days and weeks.